Today I want to talk a little bit about um, some basic formatting within tables. Um, within Microsoft Word, Office 365, there's so many options that you can have with tables. I just want to show you a couple of those points. So if you wanted to create a table, you actually go insert and there's a box there that says table. Um, and then you can select how many columns, how many rows, and it will actually make that table um, for whatever you want to do. I've made a couple of tables here, so what I'll do is I'll click inside a table, and on the top it gives you two options. So one is a table design, and one is the layout. So the layout allows you to insert rows, delete rows, columns, or the entire table. Um, if you highlight two cells, it'll allow you to merge the cells together, it'll split cells, sizes, um, where the, the formatting, so if you hit that little cross in the corner, um, you can actually format the whole text rows and things like that. What you can also do is highlight a row, hit the table design, and you can actually shade that design by colour. Um, Again, by hitting that little cross in the corner, there's options for borders, so you can have no borders, um, which is like sh as shown, or you can select the table and have all borders, and there's lots of other options for that sort of stuff. One of the main things I want to show is that um, with putting captions on this, there is a way of doing this that the software will actually automatically number the tables throughout your document and, and will update that if you insert or change tables along the way. So the way to do that is to click on the table itself. Once you're inside the table, and this is for a PC, right click on the table and then there's a option there to insert a caption. Um, and so in the caption um, part a couple of things it already shows you that it says table one the label is showing table and then this would be the same if it was for an image you could change it to figure and, and so on so we're just going to leave it table um, it's saying it's going to put that above the table again you've got options up above or below um, and lots of different things so I'll just put a, ta uh, a table, so cross data, hit OK, and you can see that it's actually put that on that table there. Um, select a second table, um, I'll just move that up. Select the second table, right mouse click, insert caption, and you can see that it's already put in table 2 um, add the text that you want to do and hit OK and so basically what you see then is that it's already automatically put in the sequence and it will put the, the listing on there so if you're doing tables within a, a big document you'll be able to as shown click on the table, insert caption um, and it will um, allow you to, to update that. And so if I was to put another table in here, just a very sm small one, I could select that, insert caption, it's going to put table 3, I'll just put in there sample, hit OK and you can see that it's actually changed that now the third table to show um, um, what we've got table one, table two, table three so that's the way to insert um, captions within your tables